Now the next controller I want to feature is a little bit more of a conventional design, and that is the Switch Plate controller from today's sponsor, MGC. If you haven't heard of them before, Mobile Gaming Core is an accessory maker that, as the name implies, has a really heavy focus on portable gaming, whether that's for a phone, tablet, or of course, the Nintendo Switch. And the Switch Plate controller is their mainline controller option for it. While its main intended use is for the Nintendo Switch where you can use it wired or wirelessly, you can also use it on PC when it is specifically in the wired mode. This is a smaller, more compact Pro Controller design for the Switch with a layout and grip design that is very reminiscent of the Xbox One controller, which is one of my personal favorite layouts, so big fan of that. The front-facing buttons and sticks have a similar tension and crispness as using an official Switch Pro Controller, though worth noting, the D-pad and L and R buttons have a clicky register, which is really nice. Uh, as far as special features go, this is a controller that offers both gyro and rumble and has a lot of different adjustable features. This remap button opens up a couple different customization features. Obviously you can use it to remap the pair of back buttons to have different additional functionalities there. You can use it in combination with the sticks to adjust stick sensitivity between four different modes and you can use it with the d-pad to adjust the rumble motors as well so you can go for either a strong rumble, medium, low, or just turn it off completely if you'd rather not have it on for certain games. And of course what third-party controller wouldn't be complete without having a good old-fashioned turbo function on top of all of that. Now the namesake feature of the Switch Plate though is the ability to be able to remove the front plate and put on a different one. Right now I've got the white design which evokes that Nintendo Switch OLED feel but if you'd prefer there's also a black cover it comes with so you can have an all black design with the neon red and blue which is a look that I really like.